And I, I failed to see that it would be possible for the United States Congress to turn it down. Uh, since, um, I mean, the European nations, we've been there for years. Uh, uh, we have taken responsibility for the survival of Bosnia when it was very, very difficult to do so. Without us, Bosnia would not have survived. Now it's a question of a task that is far simpler. Now there's a peace agreement. There's no shooting, there's no fighting. It's going in uh, with large force and going in uh, during a lot, fairly short period of time. It is a comparatively easy task. Uh, and where the United States to decline to take that on, I think that is going to have far-reaching repercussions, not only for Bosnia, but for the entire transatlantic relationship. There are going to be problems. I, I would expect a substantial number of, of those 1.3 million people from Bosnia that have sought refugee in the different Western European countries during the past few years to wish to go back. I mean, there was, um, there was an effort to try to find out among the more than 100,000 Bosnian refugees that we have in Sweden how many wish to go back, and 9 out of 10 wanted to go back. Uh, that's going to be less than easy to do, uh, but the will is there, and I think we should ease that process, but leaving the individual decision to them.